Hello, hello, hello there, my crafty buds, and it's your old crafty bud, Peggy. And I hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful weekend so far. Uh, guys, my week just kind of flew by. Uh, probably for some of you, your week drugged by, but for me, it kind of flew by. I was on vacation, didn't get to do a whole lot, you know, but uh, we did get to get out and do a little thrifting. And uh, today we went out and did a little junkin', so I thought I would share with you uh, what we got. And uh, I'm going to move you down. You're on the uh, new tripod, y'all, and it's it's really up high. <laughs> so we're going to come down a little bit here and see uh, what we got today. Let's see. Let me try and just get you down like this. There we go. Okay. We'll come on down and guys, we uh, popped into Tuesday morning. Didn't really see a whole lot today. Uh, our girl was, was uh, disgruntled in there too. She said, uh, we haven't been getting much uh, new scrapbook paper or anything like that in. And uh, it just, it sucks. So, uh, I think I got a crystal in one of these bags I got. That was about it there. But we did go to Dollar Tree, guys, and I loaded up on glassware today. And um, what I'm doing, y'all, is working on uh, glass tower uh, bird feeders and bird baths for my backyard. And these are going to be some of the things that uh, are incorporated in with the art. And I just wanted y'all to see these now. You know, guys, these are really thick... Um, really really good glassware for a dollar i mean these these stemwares are pretty darn good i i think they're all right and especially for the uh project that i'm using these here for i just think they're sensational so i got some of those and of course we loaded up on our favorite munchy treats you guys so here is your munchy fix we got quite a bit of sweets today <laughs> These are some of my favorites, y'all. I love peachios. I love Harry Bowl candies, and I love peachios. And I'm crazy about these berries. If y'all haven't tried these, oh my gosh. The only place I have found these around here is the Dollar Tree. So, I mean, these are divine, you know. I got me some of these rice roll cakes. I used to eat this cereal whenever I was a kid. Uh, it's puffed rice, and I love these because they're a lot like a Rice Krispie treat. These are really good, you guys. And then, of course, I had to have my milk chocolate caramel bar. I'm addicted to caramel, guys. Have y'all seen that Sabra hummus uh, commercial where the guy says he'd eat hummus on a piece of bark? Well, I would eat uh, caramel on a piece of bark. Guys, I've been working on... Um, some Fabergé eggs and I got me a couple of packs of these there's three of them in a thing uh, I'll do a gold one uh, and a couple of these uh, smoked ones here but I'm really having a fun time with the Fabergé egg I'll share that with you later uh, what I was working on and then of course the hubby he's done chalked down a couple bags of these had to have his M&Ms he's crazy about M&Ms and then I got me uh, some cookies <laughs> I just went munchy crazy. I got me some premium shortbread sandwich cookies with the fudge filling. Look at them. Mm, mm, mm. I just know them are going to be great. And then I was trying to be a good girl. So I got me some sun-made blueberry and Greek yogurt chip cookies. I'm going to try these. I think them look fabulous. So I'm going to try them. I'll let you all know what I think about them. Then, guys, I got me a couple of the colored blings that I didn't have. I really love this pink right here. Isn't that pretty? Ooh, look at that bling. And then I spotted these. Now, ours don't generally have these, so I got a couple packs of them. These beautiful dragonflies. Look at those. Ooh, aren't those scrumptious? I love them. Those will look great on a mini album or something, don't you think? I think them will be just fabulous. Then, guys, uh, for some of my yard art again, like I was talking about, they've got these plates over there. Now, look at these, guys. Aren't they beautiful? I mean, just look at that. For a dollar, and that's glass. You know, I just think those are sensational for a dollar. And like I said, I'm going to take you all with me out in the yard whenever I do the yard art. I'm going to do that this weekend, so... Um, these are going to be used in it, and then I got the, uh, the saucers. 
Now, aren't those gorgeous? Now, guys, just think if you're having a party or something, somebody getting married, why wouldn't you use this, uh, these plates and stuff, huh? How beautiful. I mean, look at that design on those. They're beautiful. Just gorgeous. For a dollar? I mean, really? So, yeah, both of these are going to be used in the yard art. And then the last bag that I got over i um, been really working on these cute little fairies, and I'll share one of them with you up close and personal, too. And uh, I needed a bunch of flowers. So that was the whole intent of going over there to the uh, Dollar Tree. Here's my crystal that I got at Tuesday morning. That's the only one I got was that's, that one right there. I've been really on the hunt for these big, thick, chunky ones. And over there, they're only $3.99 for this, and it's already on a bezel and everything. So that's a great buy for that. <laughs> so I got them. But uh, look at these butterflies. Y'all aren't these cute? These were only the, the only stickers I found, but I thought they were really cute. They're the uh, the 3D ones, double layers with little blings on them. And they got little music notes and words and stuff on them. I just think they're cutie pies. <laughs> and then here's my other dragonfly. I got both of those. And then I got me a bunch of these flowers, y'all. Like I said, I've been making these flower fairies, and I really love these as skirts. Aren't these gorgeous? And just for a dollar a bundle, really look at these beautiful lilies. The spring has sprung at Dollar Tree, y'all. If you've been waiting on the springtime flowers, they're in. They're set for Easter and everything. So I think these are lovely. I love these. So I mean, oh, just look at these gorgeous, gorgeous flowers. I mean, aren't them beautiful, you guys? over at the Dollar Tree, so uh, if you've been waiting, like I said again, for the spring, it is sprung. Then, guys, we went to the Sally, and uh, they had a bunch of yarn over there. Of course, I'm always getting yarn for my daughter. And uh, over there, I can get whole skeins whoop, for uh, 50 cents and a dollar. These regular skeins here are 50 cents over there, brand new skeins. So I got her all of these, and then I got her this one right here was a dollar. So, and I love that color right there. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at that. And she's really been into the yarn art here lately. She's the big yarn guru. And then, guys, for Grandma, I got her this. Uh, she, she'd always wanted to go to China. Uh, that's one of them trips, you know, you fantasize about. Well, Grammy's 105, and... None of us are no richer, and we were not able to send her to China. <laughs> but I found her this, guys. Somebody went and brought back an authentic Chinese brocade. And I want you to look at the beautifulness of this. And I thought Grammy could use this for a, a table uh, laying across. Uh, just beautiful. It's got the tags all from China. But look at this gorgeousness. Is that not scrum sumptuous, you guys? Just look at that. And it's actually a brocade that they wear underneath their, their robe. You know, the piece that you see underneath like that. That's what that is. But this is just beautiful and authentic. Absolutely scrumptious, isn't it? And I thought Grammy would love that. Uh, so I got that for her. And I thought, you know, like I said, she can use that. She's got a long table next to the window that's got her pretties on it. And uh, I thought this would be beautiful across that for her. And uh, like I said, this is authentic and comes all the way from China over there. And I just had to have it. And this is its little package. Tells all about everything. And um, just absolutely stunning. I just thought it was stunning. So she had to have it. And they even left the bookmarks. They bought a couple of uh, authentic handmade bookmarks even. And I thought she'll use those for her crossword puzzle books. That'll be beautiful. And I know Grammy will love that. So, yeah. And Grammy's going to be 106 this year, you guys. She's doing well. Uh, she said to tell everybody she said hi. And uh, thank you again. She still has her hands where she can see them. And, um... You know, everything is going well in her world for a 105-year-old woman. So, then, guys, I found a couple of punch bowls. These here I'm going to use as part of the art. Like I said, uh, this one here, I gave $5 for it. Big, nice punch bowl. 
And then I got this piece here for $4. I just love this. And I thought that would make a really nice either feeder or a bird bath. I mean, I can use this for either or in the art and uh, stack these together. Then I got uh, this piece. I just love this. I love the design of that. I just think that's just, I love that. I think that's going to look really good out there. And I can't wait to get started on that and bring you all along. Then I got another punch bowl that I'm also going to use. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to flip it like that or leave it like this. Who knows? I also found a beautiful uh, big martini glass for $2. Uh, those there were 3 and $4 for those last ones that I found. And then this one here was $3. And it's the small one to go with the other one like this. So I figured that will make a nice tier. Because they actually are... Uh, you know, twins that go together so they stack well as far as the uh, tier. And then for the top of one of them, I got this piece. And I just could not resist this. That was just stunning, I thought. And this one here was uh, $5. But it's got the gold trim, and I just love this. And I think it's just going to be stunning. Uh, guys, also today in the mail, I got in... The last of my haul, and guess what it is? Spellbinders dies, guys. I got a really good deal. One of the ladies on there had 11 packs for 40 bucks, and I snatched them up. Uh, I plan to sell several of these here in my store and keep some for myself. But I got the uh, nestled hearts. This one here is. These are nestabilities. This is the classic heart. <coughs> This one is the Standard Circle Large. I have the Classic Oval Large. I have the Classic Square Small. Uh, I also have the Arched Elegance Pocket. I got the uh, uh, Phrase Set 1 and 2. This is all of the phrases. Then I got the flower set, which is the shabby posies. I got the Renaissance Tag 2. I really love this. I think I got Renaissance Tag 1 in there in the other room. Then I got the wreath, which I really love. And then I got the uh, tab set, number 1. And guys, again, I'm not affiliated. I just happen to be drawn to Spellbinders. And for this deal, I said, you know, I can sell uh, four or five packs of these even at $10 a pop here and make my money back. And then my ones I keep are free. So, uh, you know. Anyways, guys, that was our haul for today. Uh, like I said, I've had a wonderful time off. We got to go see Grand Funk Railroad last night, guys, for free. They put on a show for us here in Hot Springs. They were part of the uh, St. Patty's Day Parade today, shortest parade in the world. We don't ever attend that, though. That corner, it's one corner, basically, and it's, God, it's nuts. But uh, we got to see the guys last night, and they rocked our butts. I'm going to tell you now, uh, just rocked us. It was fabulous. We had a great time. So, guys, I hope you guys were able to get out so far this weekend. If not, at least get outside. Just take a deep breath and enjoy the air, okay? Uh, hopefully it's smog free, <laughs> you know, do something though to uh, make yourself happy this weekend and enjoy your life. And guys, uh, those of you who are new in our world, stick around. We got a lot coming up. Like I said, I'm going to, I'm fixing to share with you guys a uh, beautiful yard art project we're going to work on. And uh, we've got some project shares coming up and just a lot of fun. So stick around. And guys, until next time, be crafty, be cool, and I'll see you when I'm looking at you, all right? Bye-bye.